Alright guys, so I am either starting or continuing a week in my life video. Um, I'm really not entirely sure what you've seen up to this point or if I even started this vlog yet. So if I haven't, hey my name is Love, I'd love you guys to stick around, subscribe down below and join the fam. We're super chill and fun over here and I'd love for you guys to be a part of us. I'm currently parked in Walmart because I am leaving for a trip and i need to get sunscreen but i also want to find another pair of these leggings that i really like they were recently on clearance for nine dollars like two three weeks ago so i'm trying to see and cross my fingers that they're still in here on clearance and yeah but if we don't find the leggings we're just gonna get the sunscreen and go because that's what we really came here for and aside from that i have to write another paper so i know in my previous week in my life video i'm gonna link it on the screen i was in starbucks one day for literally six hours straight writing a paper luckily this paper i've already started so i already have all my sources and i already have one paragraph written and i only need four more paragraphs to finish so the goal it's currently 2 p.m if i can finish this paper by five six o'clock and go back home to chill with my brothers that'd be lit because my older brother was saying how he wanted to go see a movie today he wanted us to all go watch creed 3 so that's that's lit let's go fucking do that all right let's go Hey y'all, so I'm currently at my lunch break at work and I thought the 21st was the first day of spring but it's actually, it was actually yesterday, Monday the 20th. So now I have to pay for my water ice but it's okay because I wanna treat myself anyways. So I'm in line at Rita's. There's only one other person in front of me right now. And then when I'm done here, I'm gonna go to 7-Eleven to get snacks for my trip. But like, you guys are gonna see this the week after my trip, so the trip has already came and went, so I'm gonna link it on the screen so you guys can watch the vlog of DR. But this is a random Tuesday before my trip that I'm deciding to run a couple errands on my lunch break. We got ourselves a large, cause the smalls were looking a little too small. This is Island Fusion on top. I've never had that flavor before, but it tastes like passion fruit. So it's hella good. Hella good. I'm, yeah. <laughs> this is so good. 
and then the bottom half I got watermelon because watermelon my favorite flavor okay <laughs> Still at work again, but here's the outfit. It's a plain t-shirt and this skirt, these shoes. Very simple. Okay. No, you're good. Everybody repeat after me. Say balance. Balance. I'm gonna say it again. I'm about to um fix up my hair. Wow, I'm really exposing my whole background. My whole closet's open. But anyways, I just got home from work. This is technically day one hair because my hair wasn't fully air dried last night. Um this is also a continuation of whatever day of my week, week in my life video this is. I need to do something quick and cute because I have a lot of church events this weekend. But I always do a middle part, but I never do a real middle part. I do a zigzag middle part because it just looks better. It frames my face and my widow's peak also. But I just hate that my hair has no shape. Like I've been trying to fluff it and play with it all day. I even tried to, you know, give myself a fake side part. It doesn't even wanna like uh, try to go over there because of how it dried. So we're just going to fix it because I can't, I hate the way it's sitting. So, yeah, let's do this middle part first and then we're, or, see, I'm debating if I should just take, like, the front sections like this and just do what I normally do, you know, pin it back and have it out. But I'm feeling like a claw clip hairstyle, but that's, like, basically half my head. But these curls are still so fresh. <sighs> hairstyle and that is what the back looks like and then I'm just gonna lay my edges off camera because at this point we're all adults we should know how to lay our edges I use this this is actually holy grail at this point it actually works kid you not and then obviously got to be glued will always be your best friend um because I, even though I have good edge controls, I don't trust anything because I sweat a lot. But the only thing that ever has stopped me from sweating off my edges has got to be glue. Which is why I will always use that to secure. Alright y'all, so I'm in Burlington in the fitting room. I have to get undressed because I found 
all of this and these two dresses i need a either white or tan dress for this weekend and i have this jumpsuit and i have two pairs of nike leggings that i found and some cardigans to go with the dresses for church so let's see y'all look at this jumpsuit for the first time in my life i feel short because look at my legs they are parachutes like it's too big i've been losing weight y'all i've told you i was on my weight loss but it is way too big look okay this is a size 4x i just wanted to try it on see what it looked like the top part like sort of fits but like in the waist like you can obviously cinch it but no so this is the next one this dress is super cute it fits so well it has pockets but it is tight on the sleeve like you can kind of see it through the cardigan but that's the point of the cardigan because the colors is tan and white and this is a perfect combination of both so i think this is a yes this is definitely a yes for this outfit so one of the days is wearing cream and white and this is a very pretty cream dress with all these little floral details it's from old navy it's in a 4x so there is some room in here but i don't mind this being oversized because it's just the baby doll style and the sleeves are super puffy which is cute obviously not this bra but very cute so then there's this it's just this cute white baby doll dress but i hate the sleeves because it just emphasizes like my armpit fat so this is going to be a no this is 16.99 super simple baby doll dress but i have something similar to this at home already so it's a no this is the next white dress and this is a 2x can y'all believe it like i haven't been a 2x in a minute but i told y'all it's perfect length on the sleeves perfect length reaches the knee so i can get away with just you know wearing um some short like shapewear underneath this and no tights or I can put tights with it because it's not too short in the back either like it comes down to the same exact length in the back as well $22.99 I think I'm gonna get this one and then I'm gonna get this dress and then in total that will be about $30 um, I'm not gonna get the tan dress this one because it is tight on the sleeves and I want to buy stuff I'm comfortable in so that's gonna be a no but for Easter Sunday I'm gonna wear this and then for the Easter Saturday the Saturday before Easter I'll wear the cream dress I have two things left to try on so let's get to it so I found these brown Nike leggings they fit and they're cute but they're one size too small these are 2x and like for bottoms depending on the type of legging i usually do to do a 2x or a 3x but um these ones i would want them to sit like up here so they're a little low and i feel like if i were to get active in these they would just fall right back down so these are going to be a no for today these are also nike leggings these are in a 3x fit like snug exactly where i want them 12.99 12.99 of course we're getting them we have to they're fit perfectly and i've been looking for new black like active leggings have to get them have to good morning vlog i'm continuing this uh we get my life video again i'm currently on my way to bath and body works because i have two coupons that i want to use and one of them is like a free body care item and the other one is 25 percent off my entire purchase and i don't go to bath and body works too often unless it's to like pick up my favorite like lip balm or anything and i'm still kind of stocked on those but i do think that i'm gonna try um their lip pump plumping gloss let me clean that there you go their lip plumping gloss um that they do have because i have been obsessed with wearing lip plumpers i'm not gonna hold you like i'm running low on my two favorite ones so i just you know want to try some other ones and i'm gonna see if they have their um rollerball perfumes and stuff because i have one from them that i really really love and i saw this years ago and i don't know if they still have it so i'm gonna try and see if they have it and aside from that we're just gonna try and find like whatever body care item is useful for the coupon because i really don't wear any of their lotions or any of their um 
perfumes like crazy but we're gonna see so after i do that i'm gonna go to duncan you guys know my saturday routines at this point i'd be in duncan for hours or starbucks um i'm gonna go to duncan hopefully try and get there by like 12 15 12 30 and just knock out the entire day of homework because i'm I really fell behind this past week in doing my homework and I just hate when that happens because it just adds stress for no reason. So if I can get the majority of the homework done today or at least in like half of the paper that I really need to do, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be set. We're gonna be golden. So let's go. Okay, vlog. I'll turn on the lights. This is the outfit for tit and it's the dress I got yesterday at Burlington from it's actually from Old Navy. Again, it's a size 4X. So there is extra fabric. You see this like ruffle? That's the extra fabric. But it's fine. I just found out it has pockets. Beautiful thing. For the shoes, we're going with these from Target. And we have to go to church now. Getting ice cream. We went to Rita's. I'm with a new work friend, but she's not ready to be on camera, so we're gonna respect her wishes. But we got some Rita's, and y'all know how I feel about my custard. Y'all know. So good. I went into Nike to get Nike socks, but I just couldn't pay, I could not justify paying $22 or $18 for like six or three pairs of socks. Like that's a little, I'm gonna go to the Nike outlet, maybe tomorrow or when I wanna do like a full shopping spree because $22 for six socks? No, no, could never, no.
just basically finished all of my shopping before I realized and turned on my camera like my car is full. But I'm looking at the Wild and Fable collection because I saw somebody on TikTok try on their plus jeans. Like I think it was up to a size 17. I'm not sure, but I want to try them and see how they fit. So let's look for something. These are the Wild and Fable size 18, but I cannot get them to zip because I have a belly and my belly gets tucked into my pants but they do go up that's the back over there they um they fit but like they just don't zip so here's what the back is looking like that's the back like you can see how it's like sitting on my waist and usually I like my jeans high waisted so this is a no so then there's these shorts. These are a size 18 from the Ava and Viv collection. This is the actual plus size collection at Target and they fit perfectly. This is what the back is giving. Literally perfect. Makes everything look good. And you can never have too many jean shorts. This means that I can get rid of my size 22 jean shorts because they are way too big on me and I can keep the smaller sizes. Last thing I'm trying on are these gray joggers from Wild and Fable. Um, they fit. They're not too much of a high water, which is my problem with joggers because of how high waisted I wear my leggings. So it's good to know. I'm not going to get these today, but good to know for the future.